NOAA has released its winter outlook. NOAA is the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, and they do climate outlooks for, well, the entire United States. We are projecting a strong El Nino this year. It's already looking to be a potentially record-breaking ocean temperature year uh, for us here globally. And, well, this kind of a pattern isn't all that unusual during a warm El Nino season, expecting the northern tier of the United States to see above average temperatures this winter with not really a whole lot of us expecting to have a cooler than normal trend under a strong El Nino. Now here in Kansas City, we are expecting it to be warmer and during strong El Ninos, we tend to trend three to four to even five degrees above average through the winter months. When it comes down to precipitation, that means rain and snow, the trend during a strong El Nino is to see a lot more wet weather for the southern tier of the United States. So uh, this is a pattern that is expected here in Kansas City. We are looking to be on the wetter than normal trend of this all. And what that means is, well, during strong El Nino years in Kansas City, we tend to see more rain than anything, but when it comes to snow trends during El Nino years, here's a look back at the strongest El Ninos in Kansas City's history. The uh, re most recent one, 2015 to 2016, we only saw 5.3 inches of snow, but a very strong El Nino during 1957, the winter of 1957 to 58, we saw 22.9. So when it comes to snow trends, we can be all over the place during El Nino years, but we definitely know we are going to be most likely warmer than normal and wetter than normal here in Kansas City. Now coming up, your KSHB 41 weather team has a full winter weather special. You can expect to learn a lot more about the winter season on November 29th.